Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. In a recent statement, Intel guru Frank26 raised a concern about Californians needing to be particularly careful when the time comes to exchange their Iraqi dinars. He mentioned that the political climate in California, coupled with its economic policies, could pose unique challenges for residents during the exchange process. His primary concern centers on California's high tax rates and what he calls illogical policies, which he believes will heavily impact those looking to exchange their currency. California, known for its progressive stance on various issues, often leads the nation in implementing stringent regulations and high taxes. These policies, according to Frank26, could create significant hurdles for people living in the state when it comes time to exchange Iraqi dinars or any other foreign currency that might undergo revaluation. The state's taxation system, which already burdens residents with some of the highest income and sales taxes in the country, may impose even heavier taxes on currency exchanges. For those who are not financially or legally savvy, this could result in losing a significant portion of their exchanged funds to taxes. Frank26 warns that residents of California need to be well prepared and knowledgeable about the potential taxes and regulations that could apply to their currency exchange. He suggests that the state's policies, which he considers to be indecent and illogical, are a reflection of a government that prioritizes its own revenue over the welfare of its citizens. This, in his view, is why Californians must be cautious and well-informed when the revaluation RV or exchange occurs. Moreover, he emphasizes that residents need to consult with professionals, whether they be financial advisors, tax experts, or legal professionals, to ensure they understand the specific implications of California's tax laws on their exchange process. Without this preparation, Californians may find themselves paying much more in taxes compared to residents of other states with more favorable tax policies. Frank 26's concerns aren't solely about taxes. He alludes to a broader distrust of the state's governance, noting that California's policies could create a generally unfavorable environment for those looking to make significant financial transactions. The combination of high taxes, complex regulations, and what he perceives as a lack of consideration for residents' financial well-being are all factors that, according to him, could make California a difficult place for currency holders to navigate during the exchange process. Another important point he touches on is the need for individuals to be proactive. He advises that those who hold Iraqi dinars or other currencies should not wait until the last minute to seek guidance. By planning ahead and getting a firm grasp on California's tax laws, residents will be better equipped to minimize their tax liabilities and avoid falling victim.